Hi everyone, this is Christina from EdTech and I'd like to share a resource that we have for you if you would like to download it. It's called Share to Classroom Extension. Now, if you have a Google Classroom, then you already have students rostered to your classroom. What we like to do is we wanna be able to push out websites, URLs, links, what have you, to students in your classroom. And you can do this by adding an extension called Share to Classroom. I'm going to show you first how to download it and and then what it does. So you'll want to open a Chrome browser and type in share to classroom extension, extension, and then click on the very first one that pops up. And you'll notice that I already have it installed. So I can either remove it from my Google Chrome store or you can add it right now. Now, if you add it, it's going to pop up right here in your menu tab and it's called Shared to Classroom. So if I'm working, for example, I'm going to open a website and I am wanting my students to open this writing prompt generator, I'm going to click on that website and then I'm going to go up to the Shared to Classroom extension. I'm going to choose which classroom I would like to share it with. So right now I'm going to share it just with my Google Classroom session. And you'll notice that I can do a few different options here. I can either push it to the students, which means if they are logged into their Chromebook, a brand new tab is going to open instantly for them so they can get started right away on this activity. Or I can create an assignment or an announcement and have it posted to my Google Classroom. Um, notice it will also automatically fill the website that you are located on and you can choose which class or sorry, you can choose students to push it to the whole class or just specific students. So I'm going to push it out right now. Then students will have it open a new tab and they are off and running. So I hope that this helps you save a lot of time and headache when trying to share resources with your classroom. Let me know if you have any questions along the way. And I'll